We're trying out a new barber shop today, Barber of Hell's Bottom. I drive by this place all the time and I finally got an appointment. So I'm gonna modify a little bit of a haircut I have where uh, I had a little bit kind of like almost a disconnect like two summers ago in this recent picture of Hugh Jackman style where he kind of comes a little bit more straight back. But um, my, new, my new barber, Mr. Cam, he's gonna hook it up, try to make me pretty. <laughs> So, Cam, great guy, great barber, great cut. I haven't really quite styled it how I normally do. Uh, actually even got a little bit of a beard trim. Shave, hot towel, very nice. Um, but uh, $110. Note to self, Chase, always ask for the price before you go in. Bet you guys didn't know I was so gangster. <laughs> All right, so uh, Nick is here. I actually have been keeping him waiting. My bad, dude, sorry. But uh, he is at a local barbecue place not far from my apartment. DC, DC, DC City Smokehouse, something like that. Uh, I'm gonna go pick him up. I gave him specific instructions and directions to my house. Been in town five seconds, already got lost. So I'm gonna go pick him up. Next stop, Compass. Look at him, look at him. Look at him, look at him, look at this paparazzi. America. So now that there's a bear in my house overtaking Nella, she's already like Judas out on me and I was all up on his nuts. So fun fact, this is now styled, still. Would you pay $110 for the haircut? I would never be $110 for a haircut. I was hosed, I can't believe this shit. So, all right. Better come with an over the pants handy. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, he did uh, put the seat back, had a little recline action and uh, a little trim, beard shave. Yeah. Um, but it was all like eighth grade above the waist stuff, so. Anyways, so, oh Nick, I forgot to tell you, we don't have poverty Wi-Fi here, so, like every time I, I go. Got my, I got my Wi-Fi upgraded. I was at six megabytes per second. You know what, I don't have time for your bullshit right now. I go, I've been to his place twice now, and it literally takes me days to upload a video. You're gonna upload that video, I'm gonna go ahead and call it right now. Three and a half minutes, tops. Three and a half minutes? Three and a half. What's your speed on this, this job? 110 up, 110 down. Wow. Yeah. Mom at six. <laughs> He's what you call low speed, high drag. Your boy, high speed, low drag. You play guitar or is that just for show? It's just for show. <laughs> yeah, it's just for show. <laughs> <laughs> let's, take, look, let's look at Nella. She's looking super cute right now. Nella, if you could just do less, that'd be great. Thank you so much. All right. And yes, this is strictly just for show. Yeah, dude. Guys, shut up. <laughs> All right, so I'm not gonna lie. So I picked Nick up. Oh, uh, I was pretty much on time. I didn't have to, he didn't. Dude, have to, he didn't have to. Are wait you up. kidding me? I sat in the corner of an intersection. The, no, 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 it's not important. It's not. RDC. It's not important where you sat or for how long. It's not important. Um, and then I picked him up after my $130 haircut, which I'm still kicking myself about, which is why I'll be living off of ramen and saltines for the next week. Uh, what was I gonna say? I'm stimmed out. Oh yeah, so I took him to Compass Coffee. Then. We, Dude, shut your phone up. That's yours. That's your phone. That's oh, my phone. Never mind. Uh, I can't tell if I'm stemmed out or buzzed because I took him to Uni Market. We got Taco Rian, the uh, Korean taco place. We had one beer, one 4.7 percent lager. And I'm tweaking out. You, you trying to tell me how to, how to live my life? Yeah. So, anyways, back on the couch. Uh, I'm gonna show Nick what Nick looks like on 4K. Oh shit. Natty. You're half natty though, right? Half natty. Three quarters. He's like 51% natty. 49%. So this is going to be a little, a little series called Nick Watching Nick. Dude, you know what's really like one of the most uncomfortable things ever? So I started dating this girl. Do you dating someone? Not right now, no. I started dating this girl and I'm at her apartment in Dallas. It was like kind of like right when we started dating. Oh God. And uh, I'm 35. it's me and her roommate and those two. And we're sitting there watching, and they she pull up my YouTube videos. Yeah. You know, it's always kind of like weird watching yourself. Yeah. Especially like when people don't understand like YouTube and stuff. Yeah. So like we're watching myself film one of my older videos, and I'm just like <laughs> beads of sweat are just like forming on my face, just getting uncomfortable. What was the cringe factor? So did you hit it, or was that the story? We dated for a while. Okay. Uh, He's a gentleman. He never kisses and tells. Especially on camera. <laughs> 
Oh, you're on camera? Back to Nick watching Nick. Alright, what's it gonna be? Should we watch? Let's watch the 10,000 calories she did. That's one of my old videos. That'll make me cringe pretty hard. Okay. That's crazy. So 4K Nick versus... How does that even happen? Non-4K Nick. Full-fledged. This is a good intro for this. What, what time do you have to start to do that though? Six? I think I started like seven. Yeah, Just light out. Look at those sick biscuit angles. I have Actually, to edit. Chase, I filmed this video right here with the camera you're using right now. Um, I've touched on it before, but uh, this is all part of my BPN supplements uh, sign-on bonus. Dude, 10,000 um, His check didn't clear, so he had to give me something of value. <laughs> Nella, what the hell is this? Yeah. Nella oh, likes me. All right, so, per usual, when you're a uh, husband of the year like myself, you put others before yourself. You put your wife before yourself. So May is getting first dibs on the fudge chocolate protein. So Nick, would you say, that, is this more fudgy or more chocolatey? Uh, I'd say it's about 60% fudge, 40% chocolate. Oh, you know what? Take your hand in there. You know what? Never settle, Nick. That's your problem. You never settle, right? All right, we're going in. Oh, oh. Fist deep. It accurately describes my marriage. <laughs> I can't use that. <laughs> All right, so. Fifty-one percent fudge, forty-nine percent chocolate. You know what? I didn't want to tell you that, but you are right. <laughs> I'm a scientific genius. Should I give you the beard? What do you think? How does it look on camera? Not bad. The trim looks good. Not bad, but not good. <laughs> Is that what you're telling me? I mean, it's no tuning beard. I don't know, dude. I just don't see the resemblance. How you like compass, dude? Dude. It's the best, right? I'll be honest, the strength that you conducted right here, probably the best cold brew I've ever had in my life. So Nick got, that is a red eye with their house made vanilla syrup, half vanilla syrup, or as I like to call it, half diabetes. And I'm right now I'm gonna blatantly steal Nick's amazing shot that he took the other day. Uh, it was good. Mine's better. So not only did I blatantly steal the shot that Nick took on his video, I actually made him take the shot for me. So, biceps on point today. It's the perks of being the elder. You have to respect your elders. One empty cold brew, one luggage, one. We made it. Nick Mayer. So, less than 24 hours in DC. I will be back. I want the record to state that uh, every time I go visit Nick, it's for multiple days, and I got less than 24 hours this time, so it's kind of bullshit. Keep in mind, you're leaving today. Those are semantics. They're irregardlessly, it doesn't matter. This cold brew's hitting. <laughs> it's real hard so right Nick's now. about to poop his pants. <laughs> Good seeing the bro. All right, dude. Bye, right, man. Solid hangs. Yeah, appreciate it. Dude. Don't you go dine on me. Yeah, you ready to go to the beach? Let's go to the beach, beach, let's go get a wave. They say what they're gonna say. I don't know the rest of the words. Yeah, me <laughs> All right, so Daryl and I are definitely behind schedule. Work got away from me today. Uh, we're changing cars. Daryl's driving because he's a, a sport, so I can work on the drive up. We're gonna hit the road. Next stop, Jersey. Jersey Shore weekend with the boys. Well, actually, mostly with the girls. <laughs> You realize you're driving, right? So we are in the car, northbound, heading to Jersey Shore, meet up with the ladies. And you know, with May, Kim, Kate, Nick, Knack, Patty, Whack, all the, uh, all the lady friends, Tori, and our other friend, Britt. So uh, we're finally getting some more testosterone in the group. I love it. We got three dudes. Five girls. Five girls. That's a decent ratio. Okay. So uh, always good seeing my bro, Nick Bear. He actually came into town a little bit early to go visit his family in Ocean City, Maryland for the weekend. Because him and I had some bitness, had some bitness to attend to. Um, as you all know, we're business partners on a, a cold brew project. We had a little bit of a snafu with some FDA regulations, but we have all of our equipment set up at uh, his facility there in Austin. I'm just waiting to pull the trigger on that. But uh, we have some other big, 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 big things planning. 
to come in 2018. So, uh, some fitness done now, heading to a fun in the sun weekend. It's a classic planet Earth. Dude, your sign off is terrible. There's no, there's no, I, I didn't feel that. Stay classy. Don't, don't, don't tell me, tell them. I don't, I don't tell no, them. No, I'm over it. It's done. All right, you stay classy, planet Earth.